What's up guys, I am Mohammed Mohammed, the founder of MMB Studios and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the text tool in Cfig Studio. Alright now, let's get started. First, uh, I want to start by creating a background using this rectangular creation tool. Then I'm gonna select this text tool. As you can see, these are the text creation options. I'm gonna leave everything as it is right now. And I'm gonna click on my watching space and type text tool. So as you can see now, the text is white. I'm going to change the color from here. I'm gonna make it uh, blue you can see the type of font that is available right now I can come to this style and change the style to italic or change it to change the family to Arial so these are the only type of fonts that are available in Synfix Studio and I can change the Arial to bold Arial bold and I can scale the text by dragging this orange and what I want to do is I want to use a different font as you can see it doesn't have other options of fonts like other softwares so if you want a certain font that you want to use so you should make sure you save the project I'm gonna call it text tool and I'm gonna save it at MMB tot yes it is saved and I've already copied a font and I pasted it in this MMB tot folder Make sure you copy a certain font and paste it in the folder you are using for your project. For me, this is MMB Tot, and I've pasted uh, the text, uh, the font type at MMB Tot. If you don't know, you can download other fonts online. And if you want to use your own system fonts, I'll show you how to do it right after this. So I'm going to change the family to dub this is the name of my font and immediately I place it as you can see it has changed to the font that I want to use uh, if you want to use other fonts that you have in your computer you can simply go to my computer local disk drive go to Windows check fonts this is my fonts folder so you can come, maybe I want to use this Cooper Black. I can just right click on it, copy and paste it in the folder that I'm using for my project. As you can see, the font is pasted. The name is Coop BL. So I'm going to change the font family name to Coop BL. And as you can see, it has changed to that same font style. Um, I hope Synfix Studio creates other easier and faster methods to use different font styles. Uh, but these are the main processes I follow to select different fonts in Synfix Studio. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you do, don't forget to click the subscribe button because I'm going to be uploading more videos. And don't forget to like and drop a comment if you have any question. Thank you very much.